work that, that somebody who, who might have a buried talent or a buried uh, will or, or, or longing to express themselves, and it, it's often somebody who's not good with words, you know, that, that here's how I can express myself through this. And they find an outlet, finally, here's the way I can talk to the world. We'll produce some incredible things. I think it's very important for not just artists, but other people to actually go and look at art in galleries and in museums. It's part of our heritage, our culture, and also when we look at the art of other cultures, we can see that we're all in this together and celebrate the similarities and the differences. Uh, for senior citizens like myself, who have never dabbled in the arts, black or white or other, um, I think this, there's going to be a certain amount of insecurity because you're reaching into the unknown. And, and you may have a tendency to think that I am not as good as they are or they are. For myself, the only real measurement is are you feeding your spirit? Are you growing? Are you getting any better at what you're doing? Does it fulfill you? And those are the only things that really count. When I was young, I, I believed that I was not an artist, that I could not do anything creative. In my mid-twenties, that changed. And a lot of people tell me that, they say, I don't have a creative bone in my body. And I tell them, fortunately, creativity doesn't come from our bones. And you can start to be creative at any time in your life. When you get, uh, when you get old, why, uh, you need a hobby like this. And uh, it's something that anybody can do. Uh, you don't have to have a great deal of knowledge. You just have the desire to create something and uh, something that somebody can enjoy. And uh, it, uh, it fills a lot of the uh, hours. Uh, and it's, it's opened up a whole new quota of friends for me. It, uh, it gives a person uh, a reason to go. You're working on a piece of glass and you think, well, we'll try this, we'll try that, and you go to sleep at night with a goal that tomorrow you're gonna do something else. And uh, What is it being a woman artist and what is it being an elder woman artist? been my entire life. It's who I am, what I am. Just because I've gotten older hasn't really changed what I feel about an artist. The thing that has changed is that I've gone through a lot of events and a lot of ex experiences and through all of them I maintained in my mind, in my heart, in my soul, that I am an artist and the age doesn't really matter.